Hello friends, today is day three of me going through the book Creating Money, Attracting Abundance by Senea Roman and Dwayne Packer. Um, I really like the title because in the title there's a lot of action verbs. We are creating the money. We are attracting the abundance. So it kind of gives you a sense of empowerment. Um, and today I'm just going to go over the part that I read which was about six or seven pages and it was um, the author's message. Yesterday I did the, just a general introduction. Um, the pages were a few pages that was just a general introduction. This is a message specifically from the author. And um, the author talks about how before learning this te these techniques, she was just surviving day by day. And um, there's actually two authors. And the second author, before learning these techniques, was working as a geologist, but he wanted to transition into being a spiritual teacher. And as anybody knows, whenever you transition from one career to another, that gap in between time, it's like, okay, how am I gonna be supported in between then? So the this book talks about different manifestation techniques, um, spiritual principles and processes. And so that's what the author was talking about that she and, and he applied these techniques and they were able to transition from where they were to where they wanted to be and in that they talk about the sense of self-empowerment and trust in the universe and they also talk about um i'm looking at my notes sorry new ways and experiencing how you create your reality so we're doing a paradigm shift from how we are relating to reality um, and through these processes, we are attuning ourselves to the abundance in the universe. And so just like any musical um, instrument, there's an attunement process. My old client, she used to play piano and if the piano was out of attunement, she used to hire somebody to come and tune her piano because no matter how hard she played or how great she did it, like I'm not a pianist, but whatever she did, it still didn't come, come out right unless the instrument itself was attuned. So through these processes, we are attuning ourselves. We are the instrument. Um, trying to look. And then it talks a lot about there is power in repetition. So it's a practice. So the processes in these books, the play sheets, they call them play sheets instead of worksheets, and all of the, um, what are those called? Affirmations. Um, those are all things to just keep on repeating over and over again because there is a power in repetition. There is a power in practice. Any pro athlete, they understand the idea of practice, practice, practice. And the practice is showing up and physically doing it, but it is also a mental and like spiritual practice as well. So I'm trying to see if there's anything else in this area that I wanted to talk about. It was really, really good. Um, and this is kind of honestly a rehash of what I talked about yesterday, but it's just kind of worded in different ways. And again, it's part of the practice. Um, I'll just read this part. As people use the exercises in this book and created results with them, we saw them change in marvelous ways. They developed a sense of confidence and trust in the universe. They discovered that manifestation was process of growth and increasing aliveness. They discovered that manifestation was a process of growth and increasing aliveness. They learned to take responsibility for their lives. With this, with the discovery that they could have what they wanted, came need for new levels of clarity about they want about what they want. As they got clear on what they wanted, they were able to draw to them more easily. We saw many people successful successfully transition careers, greatly increase their incomes, and let go of anxiety and worry over money. Once they were able to attract some of the materials they wanted, their attention became even more focused on the service they had to con come to contribute to humanity. Okay, that was kind of a mouthful because I was stuttering, but all of that is amazing. So I am going through this process myself of opening myself up to creating money and attracting abundance. So every single day of me reading this and talking to you is helping me in my practice um, to expand my mindset. So I hope this is a service to you as well. So from my heart to yours, I'm sending you L-O-V-E with an exclamation mark. Ciao.